What's up everybody? It's really my first video I've made of me just talking about my uh my new car. So I don't know how it's gonna come out. But what is it turning for? There we go. My, my camera keeps turning. It won't stay focused on me. There we go. I'll just flip it around. So, my new car I got. I hope you all can see it. It is a 2020 Toyota Supra. Premium. So I believe the premiums just came with the red calipers and maybe the heads up display, which shows how fast you're going, um, and the windshield. And uh, yeah, I've had it about three weeks now. And I love it. Um, I've had a lot of cars in the past. Um, lots of Fords. Um, not very many import cars, I guess you would say. But, yeah, this one is it's something special. There's just something special about this car. It really, uh, I don't know. I've never had a two seater. I've had a lot of Mustangs and um, F 150s, F 250s. And there's just something special about this car that it makes me feel good. Uh -huh. Um, the way it sounds when it's in sport mode I can hear the exhaust I can hear the um, the turbo just a little bit and it's just a really fun little zip around car whereas my last car was a Toyota Tundra and it had a, le a leveling kit and uh, a little bit of oversized tires, so that was quite a bit bigger. And this is just kind of a small, definitely a small car. Um, first time I went and looked at it, I had never seen one in person. And it was tiny. When the guy, when the salesman pulled up, I was like, what? I couldn't believe how low it was when that door opened. I couldn't believe how low the seat was. And I mean, I have had Mustangs, but none of them were none of them were this small. I don't know. Just something about it is really, really cool to me. Could be the two seats. Could be all the sounds it makes. Could be. Uh, it's just a quick little car. Uh, my my trucks I've had are just they're big. They didn't turn quickly and didn't handle real well. So going from a big truck to this is a huge difference. And now that I've been driving this for a few weeks, I really am starting to enjoy it. All right even more every day really <clears throat> I got rid of my truck because I really just wanted something fun and I had test drove one like I said 
that was back in the springtime. So, um, I wanted to keep both vehicles, but I couldn't afford it at the time. So I, I said uh, I kind of need my truck. So I kept it and passed on the Supra. But then I finally decided, you know what? I need something fun. Something that will get me out of my house a little bit more. It's a little dirty. I need to wash it soon. So yeah, I ended up selling my truck and buying this. And it's a 2020. Had like 3,000 miles on it, so that was like nothing. And yeah, so it's just an awesome little car. And also these wind deflectors, I hope those are in view. Those are aftermarket. I got those because if you're driving with the windows down at 30 plus miles an hour the wind noise is insane and yeah it's bad it, I had to roll the windows up and I really like driving with the windows down so those were a must and I got them uh, they're AMS anti anti something but if you're going to get a Supra or if you have one and the no wind noise is awful check out AMS um, they have them in different finishes I got the gloss carbon fiber to match the cover the mirror cover um, so yeah uh, just I just wanted something fun and that's what I got this car is super fun hopefully the sun isn't doing isn't taking too much again this is kind of the first video I've done so I'm not sure about the the sunlight and even my voice I don't know if you can hear me over the traffic in the background but yeah it's uh, I would highly recommend this car to I mean anybody really but if you have a family and or you need space for like a big trunk or I would say don't get this there's two cup holders and behind those is a very very small almost like a third cup holder but square here I'll show you so cup holders and then if you can see her back there there's a little opening So yeah, this is uh, my newest vehicle. Um, I kept my truck for about two and a half years. And, sorry. And, yeah, it was time. It was time for me to change it up again and get something cool. And I've also heard that upgrading these will change them and make them even faster and quicker and handle better and all that but as of right now i'm gonna keep it the way it is i'm still enjoying it after three weeks and i'm not quite ready to start upgrading it yet but yeah if uh if you have any questions about the car i'll probably make more videos as i think of more stuff to talk about uh, let me know if you, if you want to see something in particular or if you just have any questions or 
or anything just leave a comment and um, I'll do my best to answer it um, I guess that's about it so thank y'all for checking out this video I hope you like it and maybe subscribe to my channel as I will be doing upgrades at some point and I'm going to be making videos of that, obviously. Doing comparisons of before and after. I'll probably do an intake first. And then we'll see where, where it goes from there. I'd like to get some carbon fiber. More carbon fiber parts. Um... For the interior and exterior, really. So anyways, thank you for watching. And if you like this video, um, please like it and subscribe. And I'll try to think of more stuff to talk about. I know there's a bunch that I'm just forgetting. And I'm actually kind of nervous about this, how it comes out. Because... My screen right now is black, so I hope it's actually recording. Um, so, yeah, thank you. Talk to you soon. Bye.